Well, this is a little depressing. Next week, Cleveland will be losing a restaurant that helped launch us to culinary fame. Here's Andrew Horansky with why it's such a blow. It was an icon along East 4th Street, the flagship of James Beard award-winning chef Jonathan Sawyer. But now, in little more than a week, the Greenhouse Tavern will be no more. A place praised in Bon Appetit and Esquire, showcased on the Food Network and Travel Channel, an institution that helped revitalize Cleveland's food scene. Comments on the Greenhouse Facebook page today, grateful it was here, sad to see it go. I think over the next five years, we want to be very smart about where we open. Probably will be regional. Last year, Sawyer and his wife spoke with Will Ewick outside Noodle Cat in Crocker Park about his success and how much harder it was to be in the restaurant business. But now you need to be left brain and right brain, whether it's inventory, scheduling, HR, and then the PR. The comments coming only months after Sawyer closed Trentina in University Circle. Several months before, he'd closed Noodle Cat, too. For now, the greenhouse kitchen inside the Rocket Mortgage Fieldhouse remains, along with Sawyer's in Shaker Heights and Seesaw in Columbus. The next generation of food from a chef who's already defined so much. Greenhouse closes a week from Sunday. We reached out to Sawyer today. He said he's not yet ready to talk about the closing just yet, but once the final meal is served at Greenhouse, he will be ready to sit down and explain. Talk about a career that's been defined by more than just restaurants, Sarah. He's had a vinegar business. He's written two books with the next chapter now being written. I'm certainly sad to see this one go. Thanks, Drew. Sure.